How deep and wide do you think that noble was in dusts? <sighs> I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it was a good time. I, I, it's it's fine. It's Pride Month. You gotta do whatever the fuck you wanna do. It's not up to me to determine whether or not you know you can you know enjoy this or that. Do whatever you want. I just don't think Dust knew what was gonna happen in that episode. Now stuff with darkness. Darkness. Um, what is going on? She feels that she needs to own up for her family and, you know, get sold off into a marriage for the dead. And it's like, bro, we could just fucking pay it off. Can you just fucking escape with them? Why do we need to do this? It feels a little forced, but I get it. Dad is also dying. It's really sad. We can't resurrect them. People dying from natural causes. Can't resurrect. He gave us his blessings to take darkness. And Kazuma <laughs> got embarrassed and then tried to jump out the window. And then, oh boy, it's looking kind of bad. But surely we're going to go back and get darkness. Right. Let's begin today's reaction. Alders. It was her decision. She said fuck off. You're gonna explosion the wedding? We might crash the wedding today, huh? What is this thing? It's bubble wrap. They cut off that so fucking quick. Honestly, everyone has the urge to do this shit. Like, hey, I be doing this too. That's the uh, guy from Darkness's place, right? Nope. What is it? What is it? Megumin's voice commentating. Megumin is gonna bomb the wedding. Some of you guys are okay. Don't go to school tomorrow. Uh oh! Uh oh! Or people might die! Censored wizard. Rookie Slayer. Alright, let's see it. She's actually such a good street merchant now, bro. Why are these guys getting so horny over this? Did I miss something there? What did Aqua say? Why is she getting so fucking horny right now? Hold up, hold up. Watch as I pull a rookie slayer out of this little basket. Why were they getting all so horny? Did I miss? Did I not get the joke? What's a rookie slayer? Like, like, why are they getting so horny and panting and like, look at this. What? What? I love the show. No donation. Giga chat. <laughs> fucking blocks the donations. No, no, I'm not an entertainer. You're a street performer. You're a literal fucking clown of a circus. You're actually really good at it, but she's like, no, I will not make money off of this. I wanted to see a trick. We're just fucking making the dad. We're, we're honestly just like preventing the dad from getting any arrest. Like, please. He's in his fucking last moments. Please just let him live in peace. And do what? We already tried last episode. Don't forget about Pedo Neats. That's my favorite nickname for Kazuma too. He will at the very end. What? What, 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 what did you say? The man I love at a time like, I mean, Kazumi's ship has been kind of dangling in front of us, but then they've been doing Darkness Kazuma for a long time too, but uh, 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 is she confessing? Is she actually confessing? Are you talking about Kazuma? 
どうにかしてくれる。そんな人なんです。カスは probably gonna be like, oh, really? They call him. What are you fucking telling me that for? 人に好きだとか言っとけば協力すると思ったら。Denied! Confession denied! そんなにちょろくないぞ。That was. Mega bait. That was like super omega bait from the author. It's like, oh, 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 Kazumi shit. You like that shit? Ah,、uh, psych. Megami actually didn't mean it. Neither did Kazuma. But it's like, oh, maybe there's something there, though. Maybe. So, she told me, Darkness no Kekon Shiki no Higa Kitishima. Shiki nan te but smash the arima show. Ukari Mahoga don't the Shiki Joe was shown to study. Kuru Koto des. Oops, a spell, an explosion spell. また借金行かないと後悔しますよ。俺は行かないよ。カズマはダクネスがあの領主に好きにされてもいいんですか？ダクネス probably will enjoy it。お、but いいわけねえだろ。main character moment ないだろうかな。あのおっさんは目についたいい女はどんな手を使っても物にしっぽいだとよ。Epic. Dramatic moment. Aldarp. Surely you can think of some kind of underhanded solution. Mega, we're trying to have a fucking moment right now. You're making us sound like we're fucking villains here. Nah. We're gonna crash this wedding. The father gave us his blessings. Let's go. Kazuma. Okay, you can't give us any money. Yeah, no, 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 What the fuck are you saying, bro? You have connections to the craziest fucking royal clout right now. Oh, oh boy. Oh boy. Oh pie. Oh pie. Kazuma mo, nando ka shiyoto shite ita. Aww. Now Kazuma will do something. I trust him to do, take action to this. Watashi wa mas. Kazuma mo, dou ka yoku kangai. そして後悔しない道を行かされじゃ。ああ。おっ、はい、マイド。頼りにならない仲間を。見通す悪魔が喜びを踊り狂う。さあ、貴様の持てる知識の数々を見せてもらおう。could he act as the villain and ruin the wedding intentionally and delay it? like what could he do? 美人店主にチェンジだ、チェンジ。What is that? What do you do? Do you see Vanier's titties moving? He's he's imitating Wiz's insane bust right now with the boing 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 boing. The other party. The last embers of their life ignite an explosion. This is like. So for the one person. When one who wears it is fatally injured, it'll blow up. The one who wears it is fatally injured, it'll blow up. The one who wears it is fatally injured, it'll blow up. The one who wears it is fatally injured, it'll blow up. The one who wears it is fatally injured, it'll blow up. The one who wears it is fatally injured, it'll blow up. The one who wears it is fatally injured, it'll blow up. The one who wears it is fatally injured, it'll blow up. The one who wears it is fatally injured, it'll blow up. The one who wears it is fatally injured, it'll blow up. The one who wears it is fatally injured, it'll blow up. The one who wears it is fatally injured, it'll blow up. The one who wears it is fatally injured, it'll blow up. The one who wears Okay, it kills the end. It kills everybody. It's just a big explosion, right? It sounds like the vicinity, the range of the explosion. Everyone just fucking gets boom. So can we use this to then obfuscate Megumin's explosion? If they're both explosion types, then can we use this as an excuse? And then Megumin actually does it. Then we blame this thing and be like, oh, I, I, I don't, I don't know what happened. Is, is that what they're going with this? I. Who we gonna give dependent to? Who darkness? Us? Like what? What's the explosion gonna do? We're gonna. I don't know. So you're the one. Task you need to do. We go in there and blow ourselves ourselves up. So cool, did I? Oh. Because the shooter is here, so Yasuri should be done. Not here. Mitosu Akuma Vanilla will declare. The king of all the intellectual property is the king. No, the intellectual property, the rights that we have to these patents, they're gonna make more money than he has in his bag. But kind of tempting.
<laughs> Looks like we sold it off. Looks like we sold it off. <laughs> mm. 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 もちろん企んでいるぞだがまあ今回は貴様と利害が一致したので協力したまで例えばあな権利もこの際まとめて安く売ってもらおうとな What the fuck was it? You're saving in case of an emergency for instance the very secret ideas you have もしもの時のためにと貴様が隠しているさまざまな権利もこの際まとめて安く本当に厄介だな He truly does know everything それより俺が聞きたいこと分かってるんならもったいぶらいクリッターエクサスティブだ<laughs> Just when we're about to get the answers to why darkness has a dead, why does Elder so squeaky clean? It is what it is! <laughs> 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 They're a street merchant! <laughs> We also have Vanyar's mask here. Oh, Vanyar's back. That makes me mad that she's saying, Are you stupid, bro? Anytime Aqua just like, you know, has natural banter with the demons and like the devil people, because, you know, holy versus dark, like, um, the demons. Ah. She, she's. <laughs> It's just fucking annoying. That idiot saying that we're it's stupid is, Oh my god. You're the stupid one! What's going on with darkness? Stop stalling! We fucked up Alder's place. We know. We know. We ported. We ported the fucking thing to Alder's place. I know. Other infrastructure down, that's the debt. The peasants turned against the lord of the land who is Alderp. His response, get good skill issue, fuck you. Fuck you, skill issue, you're lucky you survived, next. Okay, okay, that sounds just like him. And we gave them money. The flood, aqua. Yeah, there was a lot of water damage. Aqua fucked it all up too back then, right? Yeah, the flood was the main cause of it. Yeah, the was the main cause of it. Yeah, the flood was the main cause the main cause of it. Yeah, the flood was the main cause of it. Yeah, the flood was the main cause of it. Yeah, the flood was the main cause of it. Yeah, the flood was the main cause of it. Yeah, the flood was the main and even season 2, when we visited their family, they mentioned nothing of that sort either. Dad was truly just ready to go down as a captain of the ship. <laughs> Fuck Aqua. I agree, it's all Aqua's fault. <laughs> I should be punching your fucking face in, bitch. You dumbass. It must really hurt. How much money? <laughs> Alright. Alright. I think that's worth. Give our all entire net worth. Just, just to break even. We go back to homeless days. But hey, we've been billionaires and we've also been billions in debts. But we've also become billionaires. It's, it's, it's fluctuating, right? We can make it back. Time to go poor. Ooh, La Latina. No, it's a bad, uh, isn't it superstition? Like, if you see the groom, the bride or some shit before the actual uh, wedding ceremony, you jinx it. Actually, he should enter that. He, he should enter it then, actually. I'll fire your ass! Giga chat baller. He knows. He knows what's gonna happen later.
You know what? He's like, so be it. So fucking be it, bro. Giga Chat Butler. Choose Kazuma. What's he cooking at? What is this guy doing? Wait, wait. <laughs> Frenzied personal play, my lady. From last episode, you know, the magic toys that she has. Uh, um, <clears throat> oh, yeah. Sometimes you get pent up at night and, you know, frenzied toys. Are we know about it now. Akko would probably don't care and drink shua shua. Harass Yes. Harass me more. He will. You know he will. Nah. Deep inside, you know he will. Greatest priest in town. Is it gonna be Aqua? Arc priest? This piano theme right now is the same thing that played in episode 1 during the whole construction building one. There's a very triumphant, exciting soundtrack, but this is the piano version of it. I just heard the melody. Here's the wedding! Oh! Please let him have a lie! I swear to god, I, s I swear to fucking god, if they start the fucking wedding and then, you know the line? Alright, does any- what, what, what is the line they ask, right? Does anybody have- is, is there anything that- um, what, what's the fucking line in the marriage where they're pretty much done, then they ask, does anybody have something to say? You know what I'm talking about in the wedding? Right? Without further ado- uh, fuck, what's the fucking line? Anybody know? Anybody? Holy shit, you guys are so fucking behind. Fucking, are there any objections? I think it's a different line in a marriage, bro. You guys don't fucking know what I'm talking about? Mar oh, how the fuck do you not know? If anyone has any objections, speak now or forever hold your peace. And then Mohawk stands up. Mohawk stands up and says, Nah, wait! <laughs> And then Kazuma, I just want Mohawk to have a fucking lie where he just like, you know, stops it for the party. Yo, that would be so fucking good, but we'll see. Mohawk's in play. This is reminding you of Eminence and Shadow. But imagine that this is Kazuma playing the fucking. You know, Kazuma did play his own fucking intro theme in Eminence and Shadow. He was straight up playing the whole theme when he showed up. <laughs> Lord Perv Asshat! Oriana! It's the fucking wedding! It's the same situation! <laughs> I just realized. Father's so sick, the main Ooh. butler's delivering him. <laughs> This is your, this is your wedding outfit? What the fuck is that, dude? I... <laughs> he just looks like a fucking most clownish and evil king in a children's cartoon game, bro. I don't know, but um, this is apparently the greatest priest, right? So I, I feel like these, the, the mask right now, this is an outfit. This is definitely in disguise. Is this Cosma and Aqua right here? One in the middle. I, I don't know. I feel like these two, these are not what they seem to be. And there's another character onto the right with more masks. I don't know. I hope that we've already infiltrated. Bald. Maybe that's not Aqua. I don't know. I would like to think that Aqua is in here. This is Aqua's voice actor. <laughs> this is Aqua's voice actor. You darkness are about to uh, take this old man who is like a cross between a bear and a pig as your as your bride. Do, do, do you accept? 
Alright, the Orc Priest is ready! Pressure to do marriage. Oh, Jisan! Enough, Ojisan! I agree! Let's crash this wedding! Cosmo! Oto san! Oka san! Cosmo! This is pretty heroic right now, bro. Damn! Next episode! Oh, dude, the next episode is gonna be fucking crazy. We did crash the wedding, and I hope Megumin is on standby to use explosion. And remember, there is also the pendant from Wiz in play. I'm not sure how that pendant's gonna work. Maybe we'll just give the pendant to this fucking idiot. Then we'll do fatal injury on him. Then he'll fucking blow up too on top of that. I'm not so sure. But goddamn, today's episode, it was a lot of setup and trying to figure out what is exactly going on. So Vanyar explained it to us well, right? In season one finale with the destroyer shit, yes, our town got fucked, and yes, we flooded it, and then we got more damages, but then there's also the nearby farmlands and people, and the peasants who are part of the domain that's part of Elders got upset, and basically, Darkness is dusting his family. They decided to bail everyone out. Saddling the depth, then Darkness obviously has to use her body as collateral. That's the proposition. And now we know all the secrets and we've infiltrated Aqua. It's like, um, so you are about to marry this uh, cross between man, bear, and pig. Oji-san, 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 Oji-san. Uh, do you accept? And the Cosmo's like, uh-oh, let's get out of here. We are waging war against all the nobles here, but I wonder if we're truly gonna be excommunicated or looked down upon because we have the grace of Iris. The royal kingdom, that's like our family, pretty much. I feel like everything is gonna go fine. I just wanna understand what's Megumin gonna do with the explosion and what's the pendant gonna do in this arc, but that's it for me. If you're still here, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video, check out the other playlists for more content, and until next time, take care.